Seiyu's career has been more forward these days, where their work scope does not stop at voice acting behind the scenes. They are featured on public platforms such as live streams, on magazines, and even on TV. With the way the Seiyu field looks, it makes me think that having a good look, while not a must, gives more push for popularity. Of course, I believe that it shouldn't nullify their talent as a voice actor, aka being attractive is an absolute need or else you will flop. Therefore, while we're on the topic, I would like to list my personal favorite male Seiyo visual. Disclaimer, this is my own opinion, so don't, don't be disheartened if your faves isn't here. Maybe list their names to see if others agree. Anyway, this is just for fun. Ken, a man who literally ages backward. Would you believe me if I say he is 40? In 2016, he released a photo book about his weight loss journey. I personally think he looked fine before, but if it helps boost his confidence, then I am so glad. Nothing sexier than confidence. Next, we have Sumia Tetsui. He is an arts vision newbie seiyu, half Chinese Japanese who moved to Japan when he was seven. He is also musically talented, he can compose songs and play guitar. He uploads dance and guitar covers on his, on his Instagram. Honestly, I didn't put much expectation on Seiyu dancing since it was not supposed to be their job scope, but Tetsukun's fluid and clean movements are almost on idle level. Tsuda Kenjiro, this man is just fine for real. He had always been fine back then and simply exudes more fireman as he is. I guess that's just how you age when you're unproblematic. Tsuda Ken is a man of many talents and is not all about looks. Umehara Yoichiro, this list will be invalid without this man in it. Droopy eyes, thin lips, and a small face. He has a visual that could pass as an actor, but I'm glad he's a seiyu because I am more of a 2D fan than a J-drama fan. I think pretty much everyone knows by now that he made the fact that he watches porn public, so yes fellas, don't judge a book by its cover. Still, that's what makes a door woman. Him spouting dirty jokes with a straight face. Eguchi Takuya stands at 187cm, he has a slender figure and a small model-like face. Even though he appears loved and makes questionable expressions a lot, if he stays still and gets into modeling mode, he is actually attractive. Aoi Shota I think a lot of us agree that Shotan possesses a look on a different leg from the rest. He's attractive, and I think it surpasses gender levels. You know how some men dress like women for loves? Definitely not Shotan because he can pull feminine look without looking like a joke, and he takes dolling up seriously. I think he's even prettier than most women out there. Yashiro Taku Despite the constant teasing from the fellow seiyu and tendency to self-deprecate his dark skin, I personally think his tan tone is gorgeous. I believe they tease as a light joke but I hope they could use other topics to be joked around with. Seriously. Anyway, have you seen him smiling? How is it possible to not fall in love? Literal sunshine. The sun itself. Masuda Toshiki Masu used to be a stage actor where I could say looks matter in the field and from my observation, he does not shy away from dressing up as his characters. My all-time favorite will always be Undead Sakumari from Ensemble Stars where he is basically real-life Rei. Eneki Junya, another seiyu who self-deprecate. A number of local stands have been commenting that he has a pair of dead eyes and he accepted that as a humor. He also dubbed himself as Koike Tepe with dead eyes on national TV. Perhaps to a certain extent, there is truth to it that his eyes like life, but his talent sure makes up for that. And lastly, Kumagai Kentaro. I cannot pinpoint exactly what it is about Kumachan that is so attractive. I just appreciate his whole being. His entirety is attractive to me. But I particularly love the corner of his lips when he smiles and the way his eyes smile along. I know there can only be one son, but he is also a son to me. Do you think visuals are important in this field? Is there any seiyu who caught your attention due to their good looks? Let me know in the comments. Or maybe name your favorite which I did not list in this video. Again, this is not serious, it's just for fun, so please engage nicely. I also would like to put out this sort of content again in the future where we can casually discuss seiyu things. I have several topics in mind, but drop any suggestion if you have any. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.